A long, exciting high school football season has been building up to this. We had state title bursts on the line across the metro. So let's tee this thing up and we will kick off a state semifinal edition of Football Friday Night. We start with some offensive fireworks at Staley. The undefeated Falcons clashing with the Titans of Lee Summer West. Staley kicking off to Ryan Williams here, and that, my friends, is a very bad idea. The freshman, he actually takes this one the distance to tie the game up at seven. Neither defense could stop anybody in this game at all. The Staley running game was able to be on full display as well after Williams finally gets into the end zone. We see former and future Missouri Tiger Morgan Stewart. He dives in for six. Tell you what, this is one of the best football games I have ever seen. We are tied at 63 in triple overtime right now. The winner plays the Hazelwood East Kirkwood winner next Saturday at 6.30 in St. Louis. All right, in Class 6, Blue Spring South traveling to St. Charles to take on Francis Howell. Connor Harris was a one-man wrecking crew for Blue Spring South. Here he is slipping a tackle and outrunning the safety for six points. The Jags pouncing all over Francis Howell here tonight. Here is Harris again. This time he just lowers the boom at the goal line. Blue Spring South barrels ahead in the playoffs. 28-21. They will play Christian Brothers College next Friday night at 7.30 in the title game. The Skyline Stewart checking out an all Olathe semifinal between Olathe East and Olathe South. Scoreless game early. Olathe South kicks the field goal here to go up three to nothing. The touchdowns would come later and in bunches for Olathe South. Fritz Wilbur, he's got some burners and he's turning them on. He makes it to the corner. The Falcons make it to the title game. They beat the Hawks 38-21. Olathe South will play Wichita Heights next Saturday at 1 p.m. at Washburn University. The defending 5A state champs, Blue Valley hosting Gardner Edgerton here tonight. Game tied at 7 when Kyle Zimmerman takes it. The senior quarterback leaps into the end zone. And look at this. Check out the Aaron Rodgers championship belt move there. Zimmerman and the Tigers, they were flexing their muscles tonight. Here he is scrambling in the pocket. This time he decides to unload the football to Sean Skaggs. Blue Valley knocks off the Trailblazers 34-14. The Tigers will play Hutch Saturday in Emporia. Another rematch in Class 4A, Sky Tracker also checking out Paola at Eudora. Two fantastic defenses here. Points were at a premium, and that made this play huge. Tanner Stott runs into a pile and somehow comes out the other side. He is rumbling in for the game time score. However, this great Eudora defense kept the Panthers out of pay dirt after that. Eudora tops Paola 13-10. They play Rose Hill next Saturday at Salina Central High School at 1 p.m. Okay, we saw who won on the field, but who was the big winner in the stands tonight? Our High V Spirit Award goes to the school that best represents High V Sky Tracker and NBC Action News with signs and cheers. Tonight's winner is Eudora High School. The Cardinals win a $100 gift card from High V. High V, the official sponsor of High School Spirit.